do you move 130 employees from this office into this much smaller space and keep everyone, employees and management, happy and productive? Well, it's a challenge. I'm Kaylin Rothhouse, and that's me and my first building project and my first power lunch. For as long as I can remember, I've wanted to be a designer. And now here I am creating functional and fabulous spaces. This is my client, Mark Alfieri, founder and chairman of Brandstar. And that's Carmen, his executive vice president of operations. They've asked me to take this building and turn it into a modern and efficient workspace. It's going to be a challenge, but in the end, the new space will be functional, and of course, it will most definitely be fabulous. Brandstar is a branded entertainment company that produces programming for Lifetime, Fox Business, and the History Channel. Mark Alfieri and his co-founding partner, Doug Campbell, started the company back in 1994 with only eight employees. Today, they've grown the company to over 135 employees. The company's office spaces, unfortunately, have not kept up with their growth. Employees are scattered over several floors in two different buildings and, frankly, sitting on top of each other. This is definitely not the best working environment. But Mark has a vision for a new office. However, the new office also presents its own challenges. We're in the process of going through a journey right now. We're taking 22,000 square feet of space and we're moving into an 11,000 square foot building. I'm not sure how it's all going to work and how we're going to fit together because there is a large reduction of space in there. I'm actually very excited that Mark purchased a building that's half the size. I think that he's going to be so blown away by what the smaller building actually does for him. The building is what really inspired my design concept. It's these two intersecting rectangles that come together, and that's exactly what's going to happen in his company. All these different departments and cultures are going to come together, and a new culture will emerge. In our current environment, we're on four different floors, which is creates silos within our organization, because we're not together. And one of the things that I'm excited about is the fact that we're all going to be together in one space. And we believe that that's going to allow us to have a collaborative work environment and a much more productive work environment. And Kaylin assures me, even though it, it might be a little tighter, that it, we're not gonna feel on top of each other, but yet we're gonna get the effectiveness of being together. When you work in an environment where it's very spread apart, you don't get that energy and that workflow and that, you, have you ever, when you walk into a place, you can feel that everybody is going in the same direction with the same goal, in the same speed, um, uh, and looking to do the same thing for the client. So in a smaller work environment with technology and systems and processes that allows them to do things quickly and together can increase the productivity and the speed of everything. And that new building that we're creating is centered around that concept. Now it's time to show Mark and Carmen the new building. I'm so excited. It's packed with the latest technology and I know it's gonna blow them away. Yep, I know it doesn't look like much now, but let me kind of give you an idea of where we are. So this is your reception area here. At this point in the construction, I'm sure it's really hard for Mark and Carmen to imagine what the space will be. So I've prepared for them a 3D model, which is a virtual reality animation software to really help them see what the space will look like and so that they can really imagine it. So I'm gonna walk them through that and show them and I know that they're gonna be very impressed. Mark and Carmen, I first want to show you our SmartCap IQ board. This is a full conferencing solution with touchscreen capabilities and it's really cool. Wow. So, and what you're looking at on the screen is a 3D animation rendering from Vimtrack. This is actually our building and I'm going to walk you through. So follow me. Oh wow. We're going to do a virtual tour. <laughs> yes, so we're entering the reception area. No way. And we're going to make a left down this <laughs> corridor. To your left are private offices, to your right are some unisex restrooms, and I'm taking you down toward the bullpen. I feel like I'm in the building right now. <laughs> wow, so, you even got the glass up and everything. We do. Yeah. So Mark and Carmen, here we are in the bullpen. As you know and as we've discussed, noise is one of the biggest problems in a bullpen area. So let me show you some solutions we've come up with. People aren't trying to be noisy, they're just doing their jobs. We actually used the Armstrong sound level meter to measure the sound in the space, and the noise was off the charts. The good news, it's one of those things that can be helped with the right acoustical choices. So our solution is this acoustic ceiling system from Armstrong, which provides us with sound blocking and noise reduction and is a great solution in a bullpen area and throughout the offices. So are those clouds underneath the ceiling? What's That's a cloud? 
What's what a is a cloud? So this is actually a decorative element in the ceiling. You see the cloud here? Uh -huh. This is a decorative element in the ceiling that will break up the monotony of this huge bullpen. It also adds an additional layer of noise reduction and sound blocking. So Mark and Carmen, I want to show you something else that's very cool. In our ceiling, and for our lighting throughout the building, we're using LED linear fixtures. And what makes this light fixture really cool is that it houses a sensor. This sensor allows us to do a multitude of things, like daylight harvesting, occupancy sensing, and a whole bunch of other features. So let me show you a little more about that. It's a cost-efficient system by Acuity Brands that automatically regulates the use of electric lighting in response to the amount of daylight available. The really cool part? It saves energy while maintaining consistent light in the workplace. I'm really excited about the daylight harvesting because it's going to help us with the energy efficiency, but more importantly, it's going to help us become a green company, which is the direction that we're heading. So Mark and Carmen, now I'm going to take you into our executive boardroom, which is by the reception area. And I want to show you something else that's very cool in here. So when you enter the boardroom, I want to show you something very cool. It's from Barco, and it's called ClickShare. You know when you have a presentation and everyone shows up with a different device? Someone has a Mac, another has a PC, and then others have phones? How does everyone connect? With Barco's ClickShare, you just plug in and everyone's good to go. One of the reasons this is so great is because it increases our collaboration. So I push the button and whatever I push goes up on the screen, no matter which it. computer Click you're at. and share. Wow. That's great. <laughs> That's cool. I think everything is going very well so far with Mark and Carmen. They seem to be really excited about the new space and it's all going according to plan. So something else very neat in this building is that the building has its very own sound. What kind of sound? It has an ambient sound. 